Hello there Stevos, welcome to weekly vlog 150, 150 weekly vlogs everyone, I made it. Um, anyway, <laughs> you're watching uh, the YouTube channel that is Steve Official. I'm out on this Monday afternoon, it is Monday the 20th of Feb 2023. I'm out and about, I'm currently on my way to Tower Park in Paul, just making sure no cars are coming because I'm walking through an industrial estate right now. Um, but I'm currently on my way to Tower Park to go and see Kieran for the afternoon. So without further ado guys, let's begin this week's weekly vlog by meeting up with Kieran. I don't know if that van was honking at me, but anyway, here we go. <laughs> So we are halfway through our first game. Kieran has got 72. His is just about to update. Um, up to, what is it, 73? Got one there. And I've so far got 66. Um, so there we go. I've actually got one strike so far. Kieran has got a couple of spares and a strike as well. Yeah, bad game so far. So we are halfway through our second game here at Hollywood Bowl in Tower Park. Kieran has so far got 51. He's got a couple of spares. I've got one spare so far. And I've got 43 as you can see there. <laughs> so I'm at Pizza Hut in Tower Park in Paul and I've got myself a salad bowl. Kieran's also here with his salad bowl which is nearly demolished. Nearly demolished. Um, but yeah, I've got my salad bowl, got some beetroot, got some uh, uh, sweet corn, some raisins as well. Uh, I've also got some potato salad and some coleslaw as well. Yum. So I'm going to tuck in and have that now. And this here is my lunch for today. A pizza from Pizza Hut. So there we go. So yeah, got all those pizzas. How's your pizza here? All good? Nice. Yeah, very good. Thank you. Enjoying it? Mm, very much so. <laughs> so yeah, so that's my lunch for today. And I've also got a Tango apple uh, drink as well. A massive thank you to my friend Kieran uh, for meeting up with me today at Tower Park in Poole where we went bowling and we also went to Pizza Hut together as well. Uh, as you can see there, obviously I won one. Uh, I won the first game between me and Kieran. Kieran won the second game. So yeah, nice, even, fair, really nice. Been a fantastic day. We'll be Skype video calling him on my iMac. Uh, a little bit later on this week on Thursday evening. Right now though on this uh, Monday night I'm just about to go onto my iMac and catch up on this week's episode of The Last of Us. For dinner tonight I've got pepperoni pizza with some cheesy garlic bread slices. So I've got in, into my pyjamas, I've taken Buddy and Simba for their last walks of the evening uh, around the back field and I've also made my flask of tea as well uh, to take my nighttime medication with and I've also got my flask ready for me to make a flask of tea in the morning before I set off to work as I do have work tomorrow. I'm back at work tomorrow after having nearly a week off work uh, because of holiday so uh, yeah it's, been, it's not been too bad. I mean I've spent most of my holiday attending appointments but other than that it's not been too bad, chilled, laid back, yeah. Um, I'm really looking forward to my next holiday, which is at the end of March, so I'm looking forward uh, to that. Um, anyway, I've just closed my curtains, and I'm just about to catch up on tonight's episode of Coronation Street on ITVX, on my uh, Tab S7 Plus device, uh, before I head off to bed.
of Feb 2023. That there is everything that you uh, that I have done today uh, in that little montage there. I've just got back from taking Buddy for his last walk of the evening around the neighbourhood. Couldn't take him on the backfield because it was very damp as, it, as it's uh, been raining outside. Um, but I've taken him for his last walk of the evening around uh, the neighbourhood. Uh, I also put Simba out in the back garden as well started barking even though it's like 11 o'clock at night silly dog um and <laughs> and i have also uh just done my rabbit uh done my mum's rabbits uh a rabbit bowl as well which is just a few carrots and a bit of lettuce in a bowl and now they're chomping on that uh and i've also just made myself my last flask of tea for this evening and got my flask ready for me to make in the morning when I wake up before I head off to work as well. Um, so yeah, so there we go. Anyway, uh, I'm now just about to get into my pyjamas. Now that I've got myself into my uh, pyjamas, I'm now going to head off to bed as I do have work early tomorrow morning. So for now, I'm going to close my curtains and say good night world. See you tomorrow. Good morning, Wednesday morning, Wednesday the 22nd of Feb 2023, halfway through the week, halfway through this week's weekly vlog. It has just gone five o'clock in the morning. I've got myself ready for work in terms of getting myself into my work uniform. I'm currently outside taking Buddy for his first walk of the day around the neighbourhood. Now just about to give Buddy his food and water. Just made myself a flask of tea to take with me to work. Currently on my way to work on this Wednesday morning, doing 6.45 till 10.45 a.m. this morning. Uh, straight after work, I'm going to be heading off to, into Bournemouth Town Centre, like literally straight after work. Uh, you'll find out why in the next scene of this weekly vlog. So I've just gotten into work and just before I start work, I'm having some breakfast. So I've got some instant oats, berry and cherry. It is Wednesday morning and I have got home from work. I was going to go out after work today, but I've decided to come back home because there's things that I need to do at home really and uh, yeah, I'm I'm just I'm going to go and see Ant-Man on Saturday. So there will be a review for Ant-Man. It'll be coming up later on um towards the end of this week's weekly vlog. Um I'm also going to be going to the cinema on Friday as well to see another movie, but I'll talk about that a little bit later on. Uh I've come home and Buddy has been very naughty. Take a look at this. He has basically dropped his food that I put on the floor for him this morning to eat all over the dining room floor. So I've got that to clear up in a few minutes. Um, and I've also got some other bits and pieces uh, to do as well. I've actually just had a, uh, a phone call from my manager at work um, because um, they're struggling and they're a bit short staffed tomorrow. So he's asked if I can come in and cover for a few hours. So I'm going to go to work tomorrow morning, um, So which would be nice. Um, so yes, yeah, so I'm going to do that tomorrow. So um, yeah, anyway, um, also as well, <laughs> this is also funny. So <clears throat> Saturday. Last weekend, you guys may or may not know that I went to the dentist and had a filling done, uh, had a filling updated because it had some holes in it. I've still got two other fillings which have got holes in them that need to be updated. At the moment, my next dentist appointment is at the end of March. However, though, it could get brought forward any time between now and the end of March. The reason being is because... Um, is basically because my, there's been some cancellations and my dentist is calling me to ask if I could come in and have an earlier appointment and scheduled. Anyway, so Saturday I had to cancel my um, my cinema um, to see Ant-Man on Saturday for my dentist. And it's really funny because, again, I've had to cancel my Ant-Man ticket for today. Um because obviously I'm I came back home and I'm sorting things out at home rather than going to the cinema <laughs> but it's really funny because again you know I had a I had a phone call from my dentist today asking if I could possibly go and have an appointment the problem is the appointment was at 11am and I couldn't go because I was at work so 
I couldn't attend the appointment at 11 o'clock and yeah, it it would not have been possible for me to get there by 11 o'clock. Even though I finished at 10.45, it just wouldn't have been possible for me to get there at 11 o'clock. So, <laughs> it would have been really funny if I had... If the dentist appointment, the cancellation was a little bit earlier, like, a little bit later in the day, like in the afternoon, one thirty, two o'clock or something. And again, I would have had to cancel my cinema ticket <laughs> to go and get my dent, to have my dentist appointment. <laughs> I swear, it's either, right, this dentist knows that I'm seeing Ant-Man and, <laughs> and I don't know, maybe she's seen it herself. And she's saving me the bother of going to see it. <laughs> or this is just by coincidence that she happens to have these cancellations on the days that I was meant to be seeing Ant-Man. And it's just a coincidence. I don't know. Um, <laughs> oh, man. Anyway, I have booked to go and see Ant-Man on Saturday. Whether I go and see it on Saturday is another story because, well, I don't know. I may end up having to cancel it again if the dentist finds out that I'm seeing it on Saturday and happens to have a cancellation on Saturday. Um, <laughs> oh, it's just so weird, isn't it? It really is weird. Anyway, uh, what I am going to do right now, though, is I'm just about to get out my work uniform and you guys in the next part of this weekly vlog are going to find out everything that I get up to across this afternoon in this montage. Let's take a look at this. Wednesday uh, and of course this evening I have uh, got my flask ready for me to make a flask of tea um, for work for tomorrow and I have also taken Buddy out for his last walk of the evening around the backfield got his food ready got Simba's food ready and uh, also made my last flask of tea for this evening as well as so I'm just about to have uh, my nighttime medication before I head off to bed. Uh, it is just coming up to quarter past 11 on this Wednesday evening, so I am going to head off to bed now, as I do have work tomorrow. Um, but in the meantime, though, I'm going to close my curtains and say good night, world. See you tomorrow. It is Thursday, the 23rd of February 2023, and I have just got home from work after doing a uh, 6.45 to 9.45 shift uh, today at work. It was just a bit of overtime, which was nice. Um, so I got everything done. I was going to stay till 10.45, but everything at work was just all done. So I was like, so my manager said I could go home anyway. Uh, but he really does appreciate the support that I have given him today uh, and helping out. So as always, pleasure to be working there. Um, anyway, I'm now just about to get out of my work uniform and then I'm going to go downstairs and give my mum's rabbits some food and some fresh water in their cage as well. 
So I've just taken some washing out of the tumble dryer and I'm just about to put it away in my wardrobe. So I've just made myself a flask of tea, just about to take my morning medication. My mum has gone out for an appointment. The washing machine has just done uh, its thing. So the stuff that's in this washing machine, I'm just about to put in the tumble dryer and put the tumble dryer on. And I've also got some clothes in my washing basket, some dirty washing, which I'm just about to put into the washing machine. And then I'm gonna put the washing machine on. Okay, what I'm about to do right now is I'm just about to head off into the bathroom, have a shower, have a shave, uh, brush my teeth, and also cut my nails as well as my fingernails are getting a little bit long. So I'm going to do that right now. Now taking Simba out for a walk around the backfield. Now taking Buddy for his second walk of the day around the backfield on this Thursday afternoon. For lunch today, I've got a Rustler's Bacon Cheeseburger and I've also got a packet of Pom Bears as well. Good gosh, it's so warm in my room, but I'm not complaining though. It is nice uh, when it's warm like this. Oh, I could stay in here for the rest of this evening. Actually, that's probably what I'm about to do anyway. But before I do that though, it is Thursday evening. I have spent this afternoon having a video call on WhatsApp with a friend of mine called Charlie. I was going to meet up with her uh, today, um, but due to reasons which I'm not going to go into in the weekly vlog uh, we weren't able to meet up today sadly uh, but fingers crossed though we are going to be meeting up within the next few weeks which I'm looking forward to meeting up with her and having a good catch up with her again very very soon by the way if Charlie is watching this weekly vlog massive hello uh, to her I do know she does watch these weekly vlogs um, so yeah massive hello to Charlie and uh, thank you for watching um, so yeah so I've had like a good three and a half hour video call with Charlie to have a good catch up with her um, so it's been a lovely afternoon having a video call with her uh, I have just been downstairs and made me and my mum up uh, some dinner for this evening so without further ado let's find out what I've got for dinner this evening so for dinner this evening I have got a chicken tikka masala with egg fried rice it is Thursday night and as usual on a Thursday night I'm just about to have a Skype video call with my friend Kieran on Skype via my iMac. Friday morning and I've just recorded this week's weekly podcast, these weekly podcast episode 123, 123. This week I talk about Megan Unrated, Netflix and Disney Plus in March 2023, what's coming to the streaming services and I also talk about a Galaxy Book 3 Pro review that I found online as well. Uh, if you do want to listen to this week's weekly podcast, feel free to search for it, see this weekly podcast under Spotify Music, Apple Podcast and Google Podcast. Just made myself a fir uh, my first flask of tea of the day and for breakfast today I've got chocolatey pillows. Now taking Buddy out for his first walk of the day around the backfield on this Friday morning. Now taking Simba out for his first walk of the day around the backfield. So I have just given uh, Buddy and Simba their food and fresh water and I've also just given my mum's rabbits uh, some food and some fresh water in their cage as well. Uh, now I'm just about... Uh, to take my morning medication and with my flask of tea downstairs and then I'm going to head over to the shop to go and get a drink for the cinema. Right, I have just brushed my teeth and now I'm just about to head off to go and catch the bus and go into Bournemouth. Uh, before I do head off to the cinema though, I am about to go out and have some lunch at Weatherspoons. So let's find out and see what I've got for lunch today at Weatherspoons. So I'm at Weatherspoons in Bournemouth and for lunch today I've got a chicken bacon stuffing with cranberry panini and some chips and a pint of orange juice. And here at the cinema I'm about to watch Cocaine Bear. Uh, as you can see right there I'm in screen 3, row P, seat 1. So I have just got back from watching Cocaine Bear at the cinema. Such a funny title to say, isn't it? Really, when it when you when it goes to when it comes to talking about a film that's titled Cocaine Bear. Um. <laughs> oh God. Um. But I have watched it. I'm going to give you my thoughts on it. Okay. I'll give you my rating first for it, okay? I'm going to say I'm going to give this... It's kind of an in-between. Between a 6.5 to a 7. 
I'm undecided as to what it actually, what the rating actually is. It's kind of between a 6.5 and a 7 out of 10. And the reason being is because, yes, there was some funny scenes in it that I actually enjoyed. Um, I did think it was good. There was a bit of gore to it, but not to the extent that I was kind of hoping for, like extreme gore. It was just, I don't know, average gore, I guess you could say. And the plot, the, the story for me, I kind of felt was a little bit all over the place. You had one sub story going off in this direction, another sub story going off in this direction. And then there was another sub story. There was like three different ones. And I think basically they kind of all tied together towards the end of the movie. But uh, it, was just, it was just a little bit all over the place uh, for me anyway. And I felt like, it. I mean, I know the title already sounds silly. But I feel like the plot was just getting a little bit silly, even towards the end. Um, obviously, I'm not going to go into major, major spoilers here, just in case you do want to watch it. I will say this. It was an hour and a half movie. I had somewhat of a good time watching it. But then for me, I kind of also felt like it was a little bit silly towards the end and... Yeah, this movie just, I don't know, it was just going in different directions, which I didn't really agree with, but at the same time, understand why it went down that avenue, because obviously they all came together towards the end of the movie. Um, but would it be something that I would probably go and see again in the cinemas? Probably not. If it was on a streaming service, maybe... I would probably give it another shot and watch it again if there's nothing else uh, worth watching on a streaming service. Um, but yeah, I mean, honestly, for me, partially I would say go and watch it because it is a good movie and it is fun. But then the other part of me is thinking, would would the average viewer kind of actually be able to handle the, the the silliness of the film and stuff like that, you know. Um, I mean, just what I would say is if you are going to see this movie, don't take it too seriously, okay? Don't take it too seriously. Um, so there we go. Anyway, uh, so yeah, so that's what I've uh, done. I've gone and watched that movie. You know what? I'm kind of debating whether it's worth me watching Ant-Man and the Wasp Quantumania. I really don't know. I'm not going to lie, Ant-Man for me isn't one of the strongest Marvel characters that I enjoy watching. I didn't really think much of Ant-Man and the Wasp when that came out a few years ago. And I'm hearing so many mixed reviews for Ant-Man and the Wasp Quantumania. Part of me is thinking, do I go and see it this weekend or do I hold it off until maybe next week and go and watch it next week? maybe on Wednesday or something. I'm actually debating about waiting until maybe Wednesday next week to go and watch it and then go and see it on Wednesday. I might actually do that anyway. Yeah, I think I will. Uh, right now, though, I am just about to cook some dinner. It is an oven-based meal tonight. So let's find out what I have cooked me and my mum for dinner this evening. For dinner tonight, I've got some vegetable spring rolls with some chips and some baked beans. Right, it is Friday night and I'm just about to head off to bed. I've just taken my last medication off this evening with my uh, no, uh, with my last flask of tea for this evening as well. I've also walked Buddy around uh, the back field. I've also uh, done the washing up as well downstairs in the kitchen after making tonight's dinner. Um, and I've also got my flask ready for me to make a flask of tea for work tomorrow morning before I head off to work. Anyway, uh, I am going to head off to bed, so the last thing for me to do is to close my curtains and say good night, world. <laughs> good night, world. I, I don't know why. I, I kind of went all the way over there for some weird reason. But there we go. Good night, world. <laughs> 
see you tomorrow. <laughs> it is Saturday evening, Saturday the 25th of Feb 2023. I have just woken up from a nap after coming home from work, chilling out for a little bit in the afternoon and yeah, I've just woken up from a nap pretty much for, that I've had for the last hour and a half, hour and 45 minutes. Anyway, just about to go downstairs and uh, find out what I've got for dinner this evening. And also as well, in just a few moments time, I'm about to have a crazy uh, 90 minutes because it's the return of Saturday Night Takeaway. I'm gonna watch that in a few moments as well. For dinner tonight, I've got a salmon with some mushrooms, some baked beans and some baby potatoes. Man, it is good to have the boys back on Saturday night. So I'm talking about Anton Day. Not the boys as in the boys Amazon Prime video series. Anyway, hopefully that will be back soon. Fingers crossed because I absolutely love that show. I think that show is amazing. Uh, right. Okay. I am now just about to get my shoes on and my coat. And also my hat as well, my blue hat, which I believe is still in my work bag. And I am just about to take Buddy out for his last walk of the evening around the backfield. I'm going to take him for a nice long walk, I think. Yes, uh, I'm going to do that. Uh, and then after that, I'm going to... You know what? I've, I've literally only had two drinks today, not alcoholic. Um, two drinks. First one being a flask of tea this morning when I went to work. The second being a double chop mocha drink whilst I was in work and I've not had a drink this afternoon so I'm feeling a bit parched right now so uh, I feel as though I should uh, drink something so I will do uh, once I've taken Buddy for his last walk of the evening because I'm going to make myself uh, a flask of tea um, and drink that of course um, and also as well I'm going to have a shower shave um, and brush my teeth before bed so that is my plan for the rest of this Saturday night um, I'm probably not going to vlog any more today probably not um, but I tell you what I will do though is in the next scene of the weekly vlog you guys will be treated to one more one more um, montage for this week in the weekly vlog you very very lucky viewers you very are. Uh, right, without further ado, let's find out what I'm up to on this Sunday of the weekly vlog. Before I wrap it up, let's take a look.
lasagna that you guys just saw there. I was in heaven. I was in heaven. I really was in heaven. When I was eating that lasagna. Oh my god. Um, anyway, there we go. So that is everything that I've been up to today. I've showered Buddy. I've showered myself. I've cleaned the bathroom. And I have made some dinner. Um, so there we go. I'm going to be cooking again next week. I'm actually cooking one of my fav mine and my mum's favourite meal which we only recently discovered. Um, so there we go. If I got a bit of, uh, I don't know, if I got a bit of sauce around my chops, I hope not. Um, I've noticed that a few times, by the way. You know, I have my dinner, and then I come on camera, and all of a sudden, I've got some sort of sauce around my chops. Um, so there we go. It's not intentional. It just means that I'm saving that bit for later. Um, <laughs> right, anyway, I have got to wrap this weekly vlog up because in around about half an hour's time, uh, I am going to be video calling uh, my friend Kieran, as it is Sunday night. Um, and, uh, and yeah, and obviously I need to get this vlog out for you guys to watch um, at the usual time or whenever you normally watch it during the week. Um, so yeah, so I'm going to wrap this up here, but uh, massive, massive thank you for watching. Just to let you know, by the way, uh, I am going to post this on my YouTube channel on Friday in a in a text post, I guess you could say. Uh, but there is a YouTube video coming out on Saturday next weekend. Uh, I'm going to reveal more details about it on Friday night, okay? Expect that post to be posted on my YouTube channel Roughly around about 6 p.m. Okay, it'll be a text post. It won't be a video. It'll just be a, a, a text post revealing what the YouTube video is. Or alternatively, follow me on Twitter um, at SteveFlix Plus or Instagram, Stevegram Official. And I will let you guys know there as well what the... Uh, uh, what the YouTube video is because I'm also going to post it on there as well um, also as well coming up next week in the weekly vlog I am going to be meeting up with Damon and Kim I can confirm I am meeting them looking forward to meeting up with them uh, next week in the vlog um, so we are going to be having another movie day but I love it I love movie days they, they are so awesome I really do love movie days so um I believe... Oh, should I say what movies we're watching? Nah, nah. Let's not. Let, let, me, let me give you a little tease, right? Let me give you a little tease. There's two movies that I've never seen before. Kim has never seen before. I think Damon may have seen them before. But they're classics, okay? So, I'm up for it. I'm up for seeing these two classic movies that I've never seen before and Kim has never seen before. I mean, to be honest, you guys may, if you, you know, you guys watching this may have seen them. Maybe you may not. Maybe it's not your cup of tea. But we're going to watch them some, um, in next week's weekly vlog uh, and we'll talk about them, we'll give our ratings and give our thoughts on the movies as well. Um, yeah, so that's going to be happening. So I'm having a movie day with Damon and Kim, which I'm really looking forward to. And it'll be nice as well, because honestly, I, we haven't met up this week, as you can tell from this vlog. Um, and I have missed them again. <laughs> I really have missed them. Um, but hopefully... We are going to, I mean, especially now that the days are getting lighter and, you know, and stuff like that, we will, and hopefully the weather's going to start warming up soon as well. So, fingers crossed, we will be going out, we will be doing stuff together very, very soon, okay? Um, but, yeah, so we're just waiting for the days to get a little bit lighter first, and then we'll be out there and we'll be making a lot of memories. I will be vlogging it as well. Um, and I can't wait. I really, really cannot wait for that. Um, but I am really looking forward to seeing them tomorrow. It'd be very nice to meet up with them, have a good catch up with them, and watch some very awesome move uh, movies as well with them. So yeah, really looking forward to that. Uh, what else is coming up in next week's weekly vlog? Um, oh yeah, am I or am I not 
going to watch Ant-Man and the Wasp Quantumania in next week's weekly vlog. Will I or won't I? Find out next week. It's been two weeks nearly. Um, or has it been? Has it been? No, it's been a week. It's been a week since Ant-Man came out. I've still not seen it. So, no spoilers in the comments, please. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> if you have seen it. Um, apart from that, um, yeah, I mean, I will do some other bits of... Pe actually, there is an album. There's an album that I want to talk to you guys about, actually. Um, which I'm going to talk about in next week's weekly vlog as well. It's one that I've been listening to on repeat. I just can't get enough of it. Neither. Oh, such a guilty pleasure. I'm going to talk about that in next week's weekly vlog as well. Uh, so that is all from me. Thanks for watching. Feel free to like, comment and subscribe uh, to become a Stevo. And I will be back next. Well, I'll be back Saturday with another YouTube video next weekly vlog coming up on Monday next week. But until then, though, goodbye. Thank you for watching. And I'll catch you guys in my next YouTube video.